I ordered from 310. This is the starter kit and it costs $9 and you only have to pay for the shipping. Hello, um, today I'm gonna share to you this box and I ordered this online and I want to try their starter kit while browsing the internet I also saw that um, there's a free free one free uh, taste something it's a free free trial free trial starter kit they still call it starter kit and this is what's inside the starter kit actually I was I'm already um, doing my shakes I have like <laughs> two cans there uh, the chocolate and vanilla flavor but it's not the same brand it's a different brand now with the starter kit they have this uh, choose one so that you can try uh, i mean this is the mixed berry flavor choose and this is the uh 310 lemonade that one here and the uh detox tea the hibiscus tea in this pack it says three sachets okay and then got here three flavors of the uh, 310 meal replacement shakes salted caramel vanilla flavor and the chocolate since i have here still um my uh, chocolate and vanilla with the uh this other stuff here i ordered the caramel all three flavors so it comes with the uh no i'm sorry the first one the starter kit comes with this uh fresh start guide uh those that i mentioned earlier and a ten dollars gift card and the 310 shake shaker and for the second one as i mentioned again earlier i just ordered the caramel flavor salted caramel caramel and plus the 310 shaker 310 shaker so i'm gonna try today yeah plus this uh, fresh start guide so what I'm going to do today, I'm going to try this salted caramel flavor because I'm a little bit hungry now. So let's see. This is organic, vegan, and it says here GMO free, soy free gluten-free and it has 15 grams of protein and this is good for one serving total fat is two grams and serving size is 29.8 grams calories per serving is 110 so yeah protein 15 grams carbs total carbs seven grams Dietary fiber, 5 grams. So, let's try. So, now we're going to make the shake. I tried before. I used to uh, have, I used to have the uh, almond milk. And I've also tried the uh, coconut milk. And this one is combination of the almond and the coconut milk. I just like it. I just love it. And this is unsweetened. 
and sometimes I also uh, buy the almond milk vanilla flavor. Okay, so one cup of this. Let's mix it. One cup, one cup. Okay, that's one cup. And then I put in first the liquid and the heavy, um, like fruits. This one, I have here a frozen banana because they said if you use a frozen banana, it will make your shake a little bit um, creamier, thicker and creamier. Sometimes I just eat this like this one. So we'll put everything in. I think this is one banana. And then I also add every time this one. It's a chia seed. I just got chia seeds. Chia seeds is also, they said it's a superfood. It's plant-based superfood. And um, what is this one? It's 60 calories, 11 grams, 11%. 11 it's DV fiber. And it's a good source of fiber, omega 3s. And yeah superfood and I put I add one tablespoon of this hopefully this is one tablespoon okay and sometimes I add yogurt or avocado but i already consume my consume my avocado so this is not the salted caramel and um it's really uh tasty and if you're gonna add some yogurt it will make your shake more creamier. Sometimes I also like to add blueberries. I still have blueberries there, but I just want the banana first now to be safe because um, of the flavor salted caramel. And I don't know how it will taste if I add some other kinds of fruits. And now time for my collagen. My ever, ever, ever collagen. I use the peptides because they said it's better than just the ordinary collagen. I mean, not the peptides and not the hydrolyzed, you know. And this is unflavored. So one scoop, which is equivalent to 20 grams of collagen or 20,000 milligrams of collagen. And since um, there's no avoc, since there's no avocado, I'll add my MCT oil. Just shake, shake, shake. And I'll add one tablespoon. Oops, it's more than one tablespoon. Two. It's okay. Now time to Blend. Okay, nothing else. The banana, the 310 shake, the chia seeds, the milk, and collagen. And the MCT oil. That's it. That's all for now. You can eat it with a spoon 
rather than just drinking. I'm not sure if this is thick. Let's move that aside. It's good, caramel. It's sweet. Oh, I mean, it's salted caramel. You can taste a little bit. Um, it's a little bit salty, but sweet because of the caramel, maybe. I guess. Plus the banana. Um. Hmm. I like it. If you like caramel, you will surely love this. Banana, just add banana. Or I think if you want to add sugar in this one, I mean, not sugar, yogurt, it will make your um, shake more creamier. It's not that I'm trying to lose weight. Well, I do, but not that you're really into the strict diet. I still eat rice and it's during lunchtime. And this is for dinner. I usually take my uh, shake for dinner and for the past two weeks or almost three weeks now I will take my weight and hopefully let you see but the first time I took a, a picture of the uh, weighing scale well the the number did not reflect i don't know why because it's digital maybe or something i really don't know but i lost five pounds I promise five pounds in just almost uh, three weeks of taking shakes uh replacing my dinner with a shake um but it's not really the 310 only i mean i've got the other um shake the powder shakes that I'm using I'm gonna share it to you the next time with another recipe and <coughs> yeah I lost five pounds and <clears throat> well that's an accomplishment right and um, with the collagen I feel my hair because my fair hair is so dry now it's getting a little back a little luster I guess I guess but when I was you know I, I'm really taking collagen even before and um, now and then because sometimes you know collagen is quite I mean sometimes this stuff is quite a little heavy on the pocket so but these days I'm trying to have all of this supplements as much as possible especially the vitamin C oh yeah sometimes because I have there a chewable vitamin C and it tastes really not good so I put it there together with a shake I just forgot it now so I'm gonna take it later by mouth okay so uh, yeah I'm not really into uh, losing a lot of weight but I just want to get rid a little bit because my back is killing me I have a slip disc and it's killing me so that's why I wanted to get rid of the heavy eating especially like the pizza the burgers which I did before you know almost every day so now hopefully and um, I'll share to you some recipes which I did before and since it's pumpkin time there's a lot of it there already you know you can find it in the internet but I'm really not looking at recipes on the internet I just make my own whatever is available so yeah. cheers mm. And 
you know, <clears throat> at first, what I did was trying to eat less so that my uh, system can adopt to the uh, less eating, especially the carbs. Treat myself during weekend. Yeah, I eat whatever I want to eat. So I'm not really on that kind of a strict diet. But yeah, I eat meat, I eat fish. And after some time, you know, you, you just eat less. And if I feel hungry in the evening after I ate my shake or my, you know, this food, <laughs> I just have some um, banana or I'll just drink some water or just uh, one piece of a biscuit, cookies, something like that. Not really heavy, something just to... Uh, stop your stomach from growling but it's not really that you're really really super hungry sometimes it's just your mind making a trick on you to be hungry maybe but once you uh you drink water or eat just a little bit and then you're good it's really good i love the taste of the caramel it's okay. bye